is clearly a man and no need for an introduction because we all know how big the Jacksons were and Michael who's actually the older sister and Janet who's the younger brother because this is clearly a man And the sickening thing about it is, Janet was long time considered as one of the most beautiful women. Now that's just very disturbing. And clearly it was the Illuminati behind that, making people think that this thing was good looking. It's nothing desirable or okay about a tranny. Look at his brow bone, his masculine mouth, the broad shoulders, his huge skull with this fluffy hair on it this is clearly not a feminine face and you see the eyes on Janet which are cloned on here letting you know that this is at an early age and with the Jacksons being a very heavy Masonic family Janet was never real. Even from back in the days of good times. This is clearly a man. Look at that brow bone. And that brow line. The square jaws. The five o'clock shadow. The masculine mouth. And the broad shoulders. Janet's not looking so pretty now, is it? Straight up dude. In the case of Janet, it's a man and Michael's a woman. There's an earlier video on Michael and Joe Jackson, how the father is actually a female. So, all the genders in this Masonic family have been switched out. Latoya as well is a man. So look at the square jawline on Janet. The masculine nose, mouth, the protruding brow bone. Sick and disgusting. You had young boys up to older grown men with their this Janet character on their walls. They had this fool's posters everywhere in the 90s. Tranny alert all day. Look at the square jawline, masculine mouth. This is seriously drag queen territory. You can clearly see this is a man. Bulging brow bone, square jawline. I mean, and that's why they have these characters and all these different poses creating pyramids. They're born, bred, created by the Illuminati. And whatever you get is going to be the complete opposite of what you're seeing. Clearly, Janet is a man. They can lower or heighten the pitch of any one of these characters. So yes, Janet had a voice that was a little on the higher end. Although it's a man, because it was intended that way. That's how Janet was altered as far as the voice goes physically speaking in many other ways and here's a robotoid version it's a man a straight up tranny yep bulging brow area square jaw line masculine mouth 
huge skull. That's why Janet is creepy looking. It's because you're looking at a tranny. Just filthy, disturbing stuff. Masculine, even with long hair. There's no getting around it. The way the shirt hangs off. Which, by the way, they intended to create this pyramid. Clearly, that's a boy's face. That's a masculine profile. Low square jawline, wide cheekbones, bulging brow area. Janet is rules. That's what you get from these Masonic families. The roles are reversed, and they're hollow shells inhabited by demons, just as Janet.